Hey, hello intrepid viewers, and welcome back to the banishing of Ethan Carter against very sage and no doubt wise wisdom of the angry Amish hitman. I have elected not to go back to the train uh, for no better reason than because it wouldn't be fun, and I find the concept of being locked into the bad ending uh, kind of oddly freeing. Uh, if I did go back and agonize over solving every puzzle, I think I'd grow wary and my commentary would grow even more bitter and vitriolic, which I don't know that you guys really want to hear, especially when it comes from an unjust place. Furthermore, I strongly suspect that even if I did go back and get all of the puzzles I allegedly missed, which I'm sure I did, I would almost as assuredly if I hit up, is it going to pull anything up with it? Uh, I would almost as assuredly miss puzzles. Nothing's going to come up. Uh, in a, in a, I would miss puzzles in a recording point where there would be no fixing it, and we would be in the same position anyway. And all that time would be wasted. Well, I guess not wasted purely because we would get the extra story elements that I'm missing, which I do regret missing out on extra story elements, but... I do not regret missing out on all of that walking. I feel shorter. Uh, that would be an interesting mechanic in a first person game. Is either the character model, the hero player model does change, or uh, we deliberately have like scenery that changes to make the player feel the camera is higher or lower. Pickaxe rack. Empty slot? My word, these miners are so unorganized. Scanning. Oh. oh. Okay. Well, that is not super helpful. Do I need a light? There was that thing with the oil before. Uh, don't think it's in here. I don't think there's anything in there. I think that's a Red herring! That's like the name of this game, I s Whoa. I don't think... I'm not a miner. Amongst the many things I'm not, a miner is one of them. I'm not familiar with why... Somebody would want to have water running in a mine. Maybe... I don't know what step of mining... Seems like it'd just be dangerous... To the whole mine. Okay, yeah, I don't think that's friggin' supposed to be that way. I'm pretty sure that's from a cave-in type situation. Lock broken from the outside. Victim drowned. Post-mortem? Anti-mortem? Are those things I have to find? Okay, assuming that gets big, that means I've solved the mister. Let's just put him down where he belongs. Oh, I can go up even more. Oh, curious. I want to call him back down. I want to ride that thing up. What if the body was gone? I'd be really upset. I'd be more spooked than upset. Stay in the middle. Cool. Stay in the middle. I'm going to try and find that pickaxe. From that super helpful vision I had. Good thing I'm a magic clairvoyant. It's so useful. It just shows me more or less black fields. This switches the tracks, right? But they just loop anyway. I, mean, I guess it makes sense. Pickaxe should be around here. I remember carts like these just from Infra. This game came out well before Infra, I'm pretty sure. I don't see that Goron pickaxe, though. I'm supposed to believe, I'm sure, that that victim, who I can't tell what age they are, was killed with a pickaxe. Let's just ram right through the rubble. Can we do that? Forward ramming speed. Bum 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 bum. Need to get more speed for this ram. Can I squish myself? Let's try. Nope. Okay. Can I hit the nitro? That's all I really want. Come on. Boom! Here come the drums. Okay. Why did I want to do this? I don't know. Why wouldn't I want to ride a little train around like a cool kid? 
I heard rumbling. Hmm. Suspicious, suspicious rumbling. Okay. Spec that. Let's spec that. I should bring the light with me. This basically, I think this is probably has serves no real other purpose. I have no shadow. Then to be a, a giant flashlight for me. What do we got? Ah, oh, the pickaxe. Woo, 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 woo. Yep, that's a pickaxe. I've inspected everything about it. What else could I need to know about this pickaxe? Who knows? I'll throw it on the ground. Or my inventory? I don't know. I'm gonna sneeze. Yeah, excuse me. Well, we have the pickaxe. Not sure why I care. Yet. So I still... I am learning the mechanics of this game. The things like the, uh... The word swarm. I figured out how to do those, I more or less. But, I haven't really fully grokked the puzzle structure. Like, uh... Nope. Like, I have, like, uh... Like, I don't really know what my overall goal is here. Like, there were those words, which... Seemed like they were things I needed to solve. But I don't know that's what they are. Okay, this is really long. How far do I go before I decide that I'm leaving this puzzle and going to the next puzzle? Is there going to be poison gas? Is there going to be a monster? I should turn the volume down so I don't pee my own pants. Isn't there water down here? What does it say? If this warning stands, walk no further. If this warning stands, our ritual failed. If this warning stands, the sea thing gate remains sealed. Okay. Well. The sea thing gate. Do you think they meant seething? I am there. There is a maze-ish. Don't know where in that maze I care about. A lot of candles. A lot of singing. Now, I am curious at this place. And I fully intend to come back. I'm not running away. I'm just afraid of progress and I think um, backtracking is the responsible thing to do at this time. So let's go back to that train. Trolley? What would you call that? Motor car? I'm gonna call it Desire. And do I wanna go forward or wanna go backwards? If I go backwards I can see if getting that pickaxe changed a diggy ding dong thing. If I go forward, I risk the same problem I'm currently having with that maze, where I'm not sure what is progress. I guess, I mean, so, while I started off this episode saying I wasn't going to backtrack or nothing to solve no stinking puzzles that I skipped, that does not mean I will willfully, willy-nilly, be skipping puzzles. Does light go down those shafts if I leave it right here? How well do you go down here? Not well at all. Okay, I'm gonna assume those are nothing. They're dirt. I just wanna get to this light up ahead. And if that keeps going further, then I guess I'll write it back. Oh, let's see if that pickaxe, pickaxe did anything. And if that pickaxe did nothing, is it a dead end? Dead end. Okay. Well, let's run down this hallway a little bit. Oh, that's out. Sweet bippy. That looks very therapeutic. Can I just hop right in? Whee! This is fine. Okay. I thought for sure I would die. Well, this also seems like even more like progress than the last diggy dang tunnel. Because the last tunnel at least had that little maze-like map thing. Which showed 
or at least rather didn't show any other way out. So I feel like I should probably just run around in there and uh, pick up whatever presumably is in there. It needs to be picked up and inspected and spun around and or read, etc, etc. So I guess I'll do that before going all the way back. Although maybe the whole point uh, is to do both of these tunnels, then come back to the murder victim. Should I go down here now? How much time do I want to waste going back and forth in this tunnel, I guess, is the real question. Not a lot is the answer. But it's not what I want. It's what I think is necessary. Yeah, let's just do this. Let's bite the bullet. I am not looking forward to this. You know, you know why I'm not looking forward to this? If they show me a maze, I am... I just got a sinking feeling that that means they expect me to commit that maze. That's not a maze. Commit that map to memory. So that they can then chase me with some sort of weird monster. And I'm like, oh yes, I ran down this hallway before. I know this little alcove here. I should hide in the alcove and the monster will run by me. But that's not going to happen. I'm not going to remember anything. I'm going to get killed over and over again. And that's just the way the cookie crumbles. Okay, so we're here. Excuse me. We got Notch. We got little zigzags. What do these blue things mean? I don't know. Uh, I should take a screenshot of this. If I had a million monitors, well, that'd be hard to use. If I had more than two monitors, I would take a screenshot of this and put it up on the monitor that's theoretically above this current monitor and I could just glance up to it and that would be cheating and it would be sweet. But as it is, let's just run down here. This can be... Um... I'm willing to bet I do not want him to see me. Was that a good thing? He teleports! Frack, you guys! Uh, I did not sign up... ...for a diggity dang dong horror game. I'm turning the volumes down, because I am a big baby. I don't know which one's ambient volume, voice volume, music volume. Let's turn the whole thing down by like... A hundred percent. How about I just, it's not a hundred percent. Watch as it turns out that I need audible clues, cues, both. I've just screwed myself royally. <sighs> as long as he doesn't teleport in behind me, I should be okay. We're here. Great. What the frack do I care? I don't even know why I'm down here. I don't have a goal. Uh, this is not... I hear him coming from that direction. And then run into him. Because he can teleport. Um, I don't have a goal. I feel unwell. This game is making me feel unwell. I just want puzzles. Is that too much to ask? Maybe I want the middle of the big room. I don't know. Oh, here's a body. Hello, buddy body. We beat him. We've beaten the monster. Surely he shall never haunt our steps again. Because we've beat this puzzle. We've bested... Every obstacle thrown in our way, and I am not convincing even myself. He's just gonna be right around a freaking corner. Oh, found a body. That's all I could want. It's my hopes and dreams. At the end of the day, oh god, this is the Dark Souls boss room. He's dead again. I didn't want to do that yet. It's going up. Okay, well, that's. I, I can remember that. That's pretty self-explanatory. Read! He is not dead, but eternal lie. Eternally? The god of strange aeons cannot die. We open the gate, the gate of old. Its guardian eyes have long grown cold. The name of our god, our truth, our key. He is that which is, should not be. 
And we got some burned out stuff. Text, what's that say? Okay. I was hoping the text would translate the B and the M for me. Ah, <sighs> you know what that means? It means there's probably some notes with other letters somewhere friggin' else in this maze. And I was supposed to find it and remember, like, oh yes, I remember these weird burning symbols and that'll help me later. Uh, this is an Indiana Jones puzzle I've ever seen in my life. Uh, there's more bodies out there I have to get, aren't there? What if I just step on one? What's the worst that could happen? Sense. Okay, let's sense some things. Yeah, you gonna sense things? Manipulate the gate. Okay. Well, we want the M. How many place positions are there? There is. One, two, three, four, five. Essentially, five positions. But there are more letters than that. Okay, so we got a B and M. I like that. That looks good to me. What's why would I rotate? What the frack? That looks good to me. How do I know if I've done it properly? How did you die? What the frack is going on with your body, man? Your body, man. Are you growing little skulls out? There's just holes. I can't tell if they're... Like those weird frogs that... Have like live young in their backs. You guys look the same. You guys look freaking identical. Now that you are identical. Okay, so we got the, we got the swoosh. And we got... Oh, what the heck is that? What the heck? I am so lost. Gosh dang it. Can I jump? I cannot jump. Well, we did a thing. Uh, I mean, I can only, I can only rotate the one. Oh, crap. Okay, there we go. That's pretty. <sighs> so, I'm gonna assume I only care about the outermost one. Let's make you a B. Assuming the B is even in the outer ring. There we go. And we'll make you, not you, not you. We'll make you the M. Great. So that means we have one, two, three, four more bodies to find. Four more runes. What the heck these runes mean? I don't know. I can't even inspect these gross guys. Like, what is this symbol? It's got a triangle around it. That's got a triangle around it. It's the M symbol. This is the M symbol. How many more other M symbols are there? There's another M symbol. Because these symbols do not match. Oh, it's a pentas. One, two, three, six points. One, two, three, four, five, six. You've got three points. Maybe I was off where that M should be. Let's try this again. Well, let's make, make you the M. And we'll make you, I don't know, that Klingon symbol. Whatever it is. This one? It's like a swoosh with a T and a little plus on the end. Swoosh. With a T. Yeah, that's it. That's it. And three is the other thing. Yeah, the other thing. You know, just do the other thing. Not you. Maybe you? Not you. Not... Maybe you? Is it like a hand grabbing a phone? It's too sloppy. Okay, so that was a swoosh. It's a little bee, a little horn. Uh, you. Okay. So... Assuming all this is right... That means the only two we don't know... Let me make them Z's. Um... B, E, E, M. Although... It's possible... Oh, there's no Z option. Oh, there it is. Why'd I call it a Z? Yeah. Um... If each symbol is used once... And we know... Three is the B. And that means this is also the no. We don't know three is the B. Okay, this is oh, this is fine. <sighs> Do I need to go find more bodies? Unfortunately, I think the answer is yes. I can't tell. So I I put this as three and this as six because I count the number of points, but they are also just triangles. 
This is a circle, which has zero points. Uh, maybe I shouldn't count points, I should count sides. One, is it still the same size? I mean, six is still the highest, right? I, I can't just count the external sides. That'd be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I mean, it's drawn poorly, so theoretically 12. It's gotta be the, just the line drawn, which is still six. <sighs> okay. Um, if I look at these, how many things can be one? Is there one for each one? Yes, yeah, a circle for each one. So that doesn't help anything. Position wise, could it only be one per row and column? Let's not for. Uh, I'm just gonna go and find some bodies. That seems the easiest way. I could. I mean, I could literally brute force this puzzle and try every combination, but that would probably take a very long time. In fact, it would definitely take a very long time. Okay, nobody's down here. <sighs> Who knows when the game last autosaved? The freaking ghost went way up there. Uh. Where am I? This has got to be the big room. This has got to be the big room. Let me read this thing again. Do I really think there are four letters crammed in there? Yeah, it's possible. Hopefully, there aren't, um, little corpse guys for the B and the M, the, sim the first and last symbols. Because I don't want to pull up. Where am I? Here. Okay, that confirms it. That's the big room. I'm going to go left. Where am I? God dang it. This is the way I want to go? I think this is the way I haven't gone before. Yes. Okay. That's accurate. Um, if you were on this corner, I'm looking at you from that angle. That's a buy right there. Great. Groovy. Wonderball. You look the same like all the rest. So theoretically I can follow you back, but I want to find at least one more body, I think. Although, if that body is the second or fourth symbol, then I could just brute force it very easily. He was behind me. I don't think he saw me. He didn't yell or anything. I don't know what triggers him. I don't know the rules. That's, I think that's, that's the... I mean, that's just... The general human thing. Fear of the unknown. And in games like this... I never know... Oh no. I never know what rules govern the monster. I mean, that's kind of just like what... This is where I found a body. I'm going, I've, I've been... Oh, God, no. I've been here before. So that... I don't know what has appeared, but that's what happens when you just play the game a bunch. Is you kind of just... I heard him bamf. I think this is him dying in fire again. What is this place? This is where I came from. Great. Not where I thought I was going at all. So I'm a little lost. This is going to be a long episode, I think. Maybe I should fast forward. But if I'm going to be uncomfortable and breaking out in a cold sweat constantly, I am inclined to make you lot suffer with me. Which way is this? I... Go away. Don't come this way. Nobody likes you. I want to see him disappear. Okay, so he only wants a little bit. What triggers him? Is this a time limit thing? Maybe I need to find him. Maybe I need. Maybe I shouldn't be running from him. I'm set up ahead. Yes. Okay, I'm where I thought I was. That's good. What is that? What is that? What is that? It's a candle. Great. I don't want candles. I want dead people. <sighs> I just want to double check on the state of this third body. Maybe I should just cut the episode here.